Hey guys. hey guys, welcome back to the Moran family. So I'm 26 weeks pregnant. So today we figured why not set up the baby's crib and start working on the nursery. Baby girl is going to be in our room. So it's kind of like a master bedroom shared nursery. I don't know, but she's going to be on my side of the bed. So if you guys remember, we had a lot of stuff like all on my side of the bed that we needed to go through and Benny kind of already started on it. He kind of just like moved everything out of the way. So we have to go through that later. But yeah, we're going to put the crib right here. Probably going to have to move my like nightstand table because that's probably going to be in the way. And then yeah, so we're just going to start working on it. I'm pretty excited to see it set up. Are you? Yeah, I'm excited to build it though. There's gonna be a lot of editing, I'll tell you that. <laughs> Dust bunnies. <laughs> Give me that. I don't think we've had a new, like, brand new crib before, have we? No, we never have. But yeah, Benny's right. This is like our first time ever having a new crib. Cause with Layla, with Layla, we never use a crib. And even then, I think the one that we did get was like, somebody gave it to my mom. Yeah, like we were given a crib, but it wasn't in like the best condition. And then plus we, like the three of us were still living at my mom's house and we literally were sleeping on a twin bed, which is so insane to think about now. But yeah, so we just never had the room to have a crib for Layla. So we never used one with her. And then for Rory, the crib that I did use for her was also given to us. So it was also a used crib. But yeah, so this is literally our first time like setting up a new crib for one of our kids which is so crazy because it's baby number four you want to say hi to the Moran family say hi hi look right here say hi Moran family I'm me. what are mommy and daddy doing do you know what is that what nope. is that <laughs> look turn around this is this is baby sister's crib. That's where she's gonna sleep. I'm calling you. You wanna go with me where? Yeah. You wanna go in the crib? You wanna test it out for baby sister? Okay, you can test it out when it's done, okay? We thought we had a defective crib right now because when you put this one right here, like the holes just do not line up on the side, but I do it just, time, right? it turns out <laughs> Benny just did these two end pieces wrong. So the holes, like this thing has to be turned around so that way the holes are on the outer. This happens every time Benny builds something. <laughs> he misses one step just by a little and it throws the whole thing off. Finally back at the steps that we made it to. And it finally lines up. <laughs> so no defective crib. He's just a defective brain. It's <laughs> just a defective husband. <laughs> Seize the moment. Have you even noticed? I'm thinking, I'm thinking about me. I'm thinking, I'm thinking about me. I'm having a hard time not doing anything other than thinking about you. So thinking, I'm thinking about me. Cause I've been thinking about you. 
done building the crib and here's the mattress that we have we used it for Aurora when she was in her crib yeah <laughs> so we're gonna use it for baby girl mm -hmm. this was Rory's we still have yours too it's in the back room but yours is older this one's newer so that's why we're using this one because the one that we use for you um, my mom gave it to us. So that one's like a couple years old. This one we bought when Rory was a baby. So this one is pretty new. Because she hasn't used it for a while. Because remember, we had to move from Hawaii to California. Yeah, so this one's going to be the one we use. What is this, Daddy? It's like it doesn't fit. <laughs> Ooh, I'm so excited. I'm going in. You want to go in it? Want to test it out? Okay, hold on. Just Can I put it backwards. Or would I break it? Is that where you yeah, want it? Too heavy. Mm -hmm. You don't want to push up against the wall? Yeah, but I don't think I want it pushed back against the wall like that. Oh. Mama! Mama! Mama puts you in? I think I want it set. You're too heavy for her. Look, look, I'll help you. Ready? Yeah. Woo! <laughs> we got baby girl's crib all set up. You a baby? <laughs> and our baby's testing it out. How does it feel? Yeah. Good? Is baby sister gonna love it? <laughs> She's having too much apart. fun in here. <laughs> <laughs> Don't even say that. It looks so good. And I feel like it matches our room perfectly. Yeah. The reason why I like this crib is because, if you guys can tell, like, the way the legs are, that's the way, oh, you can't really tell right now because Benny has a lot of stuff, but it's literally the same exact legs that's on Benny's nightstand. So I feel like it looks so good. I'm so excited. It fits. I can literally stick my fingers in between you. Oh, yeah, good. I'm saying, so you want to push it against the wall, so there's not there's just random space over here. Yeah, you're right, because I'm not going to be able to put anything over there. No, I don't know. I feel it. like it looks weird, though. It doesn't. It looks I fine. No, I, I don't know. It looks fine. And then look. Watch out, girlies. Yeah, baby girl's head over here. So that way, whenever you do wake up, you can see our face right here. Maybe all right. I mean, I guess. I don't know. I don't know, what do you guys think? Should I, we have it like pushed all the way back against the wall right there so that way there's not like the open space? Or should we have it like the way I had it kind of like centered on this wall? I don't know, let me know you guys' thoughts. Yeah, I'm so excited, it looks good. High five, babe, that was all you. Yeah, too bad I messed it up. I was like, <laughs> I was so proud of myself. I was like, man, I'm getting this all in one try. Yeah, and he was going so, so fast too. I was like, wow, we're almost done. But little did we know. Now we have the exciting part. We. Mean we. We mean we. But you're not gonna help me. I can. I mean, I can go through. I can go through most of it. My well, I don't know. I feel like most of this is all your stuff, though. That's why I didn't touch it. It's not. It is. It really is. There's like movies in here yeah, and like those are not only my your movies. game stuff. Do you really think I want Edward Scissorhands? Okay, fine. <laughs> so I'll go through. I'll go through all of the stuff then, and I'll make piles of like stuff that I'm not sure. Got it? Huh? Sound like a plan? I didn't hear you because Layla's talking to me. <laughs> I'll go through everything, and I'll make piles of like things that I'm not sure of, trash and all that, and then I'll call you in here. Okay. Can me and voice oh, you clean up my side of the bed? Yes. Cause I know the people get scared sometimes. Hope it's not this time. Cause I might go too fast. We're still going through like everything in our room. 
And I came across these pictures that I wanted Can to I share with you guys. Mama? Yeah, Can so this, this one, one. Hold on, wait, it's not focusing. This so this one is mommy and daddy at prom. Yeah. And then this is mom. I was pregnant right here with Leipu. I blame and then you this one is mommy. <laughs> Stop. And then, this and then yeah, mommy this is when I was pregnant Dada. with Layla. Sorry. Look at Benny, he looks like a baby. <laughs> you do. And this is this me is, and Mama and Dada. Yeah, and this this one is, is me and Mama. Mm -hmm. And me and Layla took Valentine's Day pictures. You so chunky. Yeah, <laughs> chunky baby. You were two months old in this picture. Around. Uh, memories. Where does the time go? Now we're about to have our fourth baby stop. <laughs> I'm going to put that in here. <laughs> yeah, guys, Brittany made me fat. No, I didn't. I used to be good looking. She, she turned me fat so that way none of the other girls would like me. I used to be good looking too. You are good looking. I just wanted to hear you say it. Oh my goodness. <laughs> I'm just kidding. You see this, guys? <laughs> That's the true her. <laughs> Alright, Joe. If I when I get back in shape, shoot. When I get back in shape, when baby girl is out, like work out. Even when I'm people being... see you from behind, like you don't look pregnant from behind. And then I turn around, they're like, oh. Whoa, whoa, yeah. So like, if you if you were like at a at a club or something, they'd be like, dang girl, what's up? What's up? And then you turn around, like, and they'd be like, what the heck? And then they see me sitting next to you and you're like, you let that guy get you have a baby? And you're like, actually, we have four together. And I'm like. <laughs> <laughs> you guys see the conversations that we have? You calling us, Rory? She said, I think she said mom or dad. I think she's calling me. Yeah, Rory's going through this phase right now where she literally like. Doesn't want to walk. Yeah, she doesn't want to walk. She wants me to carry her all the time. She wants me to be around her all the time. She wants me to put her to bed every single night. Like, she's going through, like, a really bad, like... Regression? Yeah. And she's... Well, yeah, I think it's because the baby, the baby yeah. But. And she's been doing oh, this weird thing, and she's like... Uh, I can't walk. I yeah, can't she walk. does this. She does this thing where she'll take like a couple steps, and then she goes, "I can't walk my legs," cause she needs to be carried. So yeah, she likes carry. Yeah, and then we're also still working on the potty with Aurora too. I got a few like questions for update on that, and uh, guys, she was doing so good in the beginning. I thought for sure, like she had it down, and I was so excited because I thought you know diapers were like behind us i mean i haven't bought diapers in a long time but she's wearing pull-ups which are practically the same thing so yeah she's just having like a really bad like regression in a lot of areas but i know it's normal just because you know there's about to be another baby and then i think she's starting to since she's getting like since she's a little bit older she like understands more now because with everly i don't think she really like understood that there was actually going to be like a baby in the house now she's starting to realize it because she sees like all of the baby things like the crib and stuff so i think she's just having lots of feelings about it so i know it's normal so i'm just trying to be patient with her yeah, she's but she could be the only little baby even <laughs> pictures of me being a baby she's like no sissy not baby i'm baby yeah so i'm just trying to be patient with her but some days it's harder than others because it can be really frustrating when she acts like that but like i said i know it's normal so i'm just trying my best to be patient mommy with her but yeah that's a little update on aurora and what's been going on with her all right so i think i'm officially done in the room for today so i cleared off this like i said this is going to be baby girls is like changing area so that's like all of her things right now that i'm just like i've been collecting and then cleared out all of the stuff right here we just have her car seat right here her stroller we haven't opened that yet we'll probably open that like as it gets closer and then her crib and Benny cleaned up his area 
and then our closet is pretty much all clean too so i still have like some stuff right here like this is all like my diaper bags and then i have some of baby girl stuff right here i also have some more like organization baby things right here i have her play gym and then I still need to get some shelves for my closet right here. So that way I can put some of her stuff here. And then once I wash like all of our baby clothes, it's going to go right there. But yeah, our room is slowly starting to come along for baby girl. Still so much to do, but like I said, I'm 26 weeks. So I'll do that as I get closer, but I just really wanted to set up the crib and I'm so excited it's finally up. Another thing I want to tackle today is just working on the girls' room. So I wanted to strip their beds and wash like all the pillowcases and the sheets and their comforters. And then I think I also wanted to go through these wooden bins because I think Layla has been stuffing like random things in here. So I just want to go through them. And then maybe organize some of the books. Maybe put like the extra books in the bins because they have so many books they just don't fit. And just kind of clean up in here because the girls kind of have like little messes everywhere. So yeah, I'm just going to work in this room. blankets and sheets are in the wash and then I took the laundry basket that was right here and I put it in the closet because the baby's crib is no longer I mean the baby's mattress is no longer in the closet so that freed up some space so I worked on that and then I organized some of the books I put all of like the extra books inside of this bin and then there's just like random extra toys from the playroom in here. And then all of Layla's like bags, overnight bags, and backpacks and purses and all that is in there. So yeah, I didn't do too much in here, but I just wanted to tackle that, get it done. Alright guys, well I think I'm finally done cleaning for the day. I guess you could say my nesting mode is kicked in because for the past couple days all I've been wanting to do is like organize and clean things. I also want to clean like the fridge and stuff, but I have to eat lunch and I'm pretty sure it's past lunch time. What time is it, Benjamin? It's only 104. It's only 104? Yeah. I thought it was like three o'clock. No, that's why I wanted to get done early. That's why I wanted oh to do it gosh. earlier so I can do it and get it all knocked out. So that way by the time we are done, it'll be like lunch because the girls still want to go swimming. Oh, okay. Well, we might go swimming, I guess then. And then since it's so early, I might go ahead and clean the fridge. I'm like one of those people that once I start like doing something, I have to like finish it. Especially 
if I have energy because some days I just don't have energy. So on the days that I do, I kind of try to take advantage of it. But anyways, guys, I'm going to go ahead and end this vlog here. But if you enjoyed it, make sure you give it a thumbs up. Make sure you're subscribed to the Moran family. <laughs> Make sure you hit that bell. That way you guys always get notified every single time we upload. And we'll see you guys in our next video. Bye guys.